Welcome to e-learning platform of Christ College. In the previous sessions, we discussed about different type of pollution and pollutant. Now, we detail, regards, study in detail about water pollution. First, we define water pollution. Water pollution is the contamination of water bodies. Water bodies like uh, lakes, river, oceans, aquifers and ground, groundwater very often by human activities that is called water pollution that is a contamination of water bodies it occurs when pollutants uh, pollutants means particulate matter chemicals solid waste liquid waste etc are discharged directly or indirectly into the water bodies without enough treatment to get rid of harmful components that is called water pollution Water pollution is mainly defined as an undesirable change in the components of water by adding foreign materials. Pollutants get into the water mainly by human causes or factories. Water pollution is the second most imperative environmental concern along with air pollution. Now we discuss about, nowadays we discuss about Delhi air pollution same type of uh, pollution will be happened per in water also any change or modification in the physical chemical and biological properties of water that will have a detrimental consequence on living things is water pollution simply this is the water pollution next we discuss about the different sources of water pollution Mainly there are the source of water pollution is classified into two groups that is point source and non-point source. First, point source refers to the pollutant that belongs to the single source is known as point source of water pollution. Examples of this would be emission from factories into the water. There is an outlet of treatment that drenched water is coming to a particular point to a particular river. That is an example for point water pollution. Next is a non-point source of water pollution means pollutant emitted from multiple sources uh, contaminated after rain that have traveled through several regions may also be considered as a non-point source of pollution. After a rain or a rainy season different type of polluted water is coming to water streams and it is also polluted. That's a unidentified source is known as non-point source of pollution and point source means we can identify a particular location that is called point source. Point source of pollution refers to the contaminant that enter a waterway through a discrete conveyance such as pipe or ditch that is point source then non-point source pollution is referred to diffuse contamination that does not originate from a single discrete source that is the difference between point source and non-point sources then what are the type of water pollution there are many type of water pollution because water come from many sources here a few type of water pollution are discussed first one is a nutrient pollution some wastewater Fertilizers and sewage contain high level of nutrients. If they end up the water body, they encourage algae and weed growth in the water. This will make water the uh, make the water undesirable. And even a clog filter. Too much algae will also use up all the oxygen in the water. That is a dissolved oxygen in the water. And other water organism in the water will die out of oxygen starvation. This phenomenon is known as eutrophication and sometimes it is called cultural eutrophication. Also it is known as, the process is known as algal bloom. The growth of algae will high in a nutrient rich medium. This is a nutrient impact of nutrient pollution. The impact of nutrient pollution is the algal bloom and um, eutrophication. Second is the surface water pollution. Surface water include natural water found on earth surface like river, lake, lagoons and oceans. 
hazardous substance coming into contact with this, this surface water dissolving or mixing physically with the water can be called surface water pollution the same type of pollution is occurring in groundwater it is also known as ground water pollution the main causative factor for surface water pollution including discharge of waste from municipal or industrial area to the water system next type of pollution is the oxygen depleting commodities pollution Water bodies have microorganisms, you all know, different type of microbes uh, and small organisms are living in the water. These include aerobic and anaerobic organisms. When too much of biodegradable material end up in the water, it encourages more microorganisms growth and they use up more oxygen in the water. If oxygen is depleted, aerobic organisms die and anaerobic organisms grow more to produce harmful toxins such as ammonia and sulfide. Uh, for some uh, example, some waste water and drawing channels, that is sewerage channels, there is different smells, hydrogen sulfide smell is produced due to this type of anaerobic action. This is the oxygen the impact of oxygen depleting. Come on, next is a suspended matter, some pollutants, that is Substance particles, so particles and chemicals do not easily dissolve in water. This kind of material is called particulate matter. Some suspended pollutants later settle under the water body. This can harm and even kill aquatic life that live in the floor of water bodies. So plankton species are affected by this type of suspended matter. And dumping of a tire, you are used tires to the sea floor also contribute this type of pollution. Next is the chemical water pollution. Many industries and farmers work with chemicals that end up in water. That is agricultural practice including usage of fertilizers will contribute for this type of pollution. This is common with point source of pollution. This include chemicals that are used to control weeds, insects and pests. Metals and solvent from industry can pollute water bodies. Um, these are the po poisonous to many forms of aquatic life and may slow their development, make them infertile and kill them. These are the different impacts of aquatic organism due to this chemical water pollution and also the different chemicals that change the color of water also. Then next type of pollution is oil pollution by oil industries. It is a, during the shipping of petroleum products, runoff and dumping of oil on the ocean surface happen every day. Oil spill cause major problem and can extremely harmful to local marine wildlife such as fish, baits, sea otters, etc. Because oil does not dissolve, it stay on water, stay on the water surface and suffocates fish. Then the, it will, uh, the productivity of uh, fish will be reduced. Oil also get caught in the feather of seabeds, making it difficult for them to fly. Some animals die as a result of this process. These are the another impact of uh, water pollution. These are the pictures showing oil pollution and it's oil leakage from a ship. Other cause of water pollution is sewage and wastewater. There is sewage coming from household activities. Uh, there is sewage is the term used for wastewater that often contain fish, urine and laundry waste. This sewage and the wastewater that is produced by each household is chemically treated and released into the sea with fresh water. The sewage water carries harmful bacteria and chemicals that can cause serious health problems. Mainly these pathogens that present uh, in water that cause different type of waterborne diseases to plants, animals and human beings. Then water quality parameters. For the analysis of water quality, uh, 
uh, we take different parameters that is including male in their pH, conductivity, hardness, alkalinity, temperature, chemical oxygen demand, biochemical oxygen demand or BOD, then dissolved oxygen demand that is DO are analyzed. Thank you.